All right, Franklin. What have we got going on next year? We have Stranger Freaks up there. Not much. I think it's time to go to go jump onto Mike. Yeah, he's got four. What do you got going on? Let's switch it up here. Oh, he's somewhere in the hills. Hollywood Hills, what you doing, bro? What? You worried about a wildfire? Then you should be worried about me coming around and burning your house down. Yeah, yeah. Jeez. Alright. We're definitely not taking that. No chance. Right. Well, we're in the Hollywood Hills. Let me get time to start making some moves on the stock market. Here's a link to the stock market. You start it buy low and sell high. Alright, sounds good. G Wagon, what do we have here at this parking lot? Do you have anything good? Yeah, who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. Oh, <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. What you do's your business, bro. Anyway, Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintegrated my team in Burundi after the design got signed off. And now, my shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work. And I thought maybe you could provide. I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down, aren't I? I guess you are. Hey, I'll be in touch if anything comes up. Okay, so we got a Bugatti. What is this? Ooh. This is like almost like a, a unicorn. That looks dope. We might have to take that. Unicorn or an SV. Please, I think. Oh, come on. Don't touch me! Oh, you don't have to call to tell me that. Not you, the Dieter Sachs door detective. There's been a misunderstanding. I need you to help clear it up. I. <clears throat> oh, now you want me. All right, I'm coming. The one phone call rule is for real policemen, you worthless turd. I we're gonna steal this car, the unicorn. Or the unicorn wannabe, really. So we'll see. Let's go find Amanda. See what she needs from us. Now she needs me. That should not be a cop car. Like I don't know what's going on with that. I need to look, look, look that up and just see if I can fix that somehow. That is just dumb. Ah, let's use these cops. Like, all I did is just lightly hit a cop. Give me a ticket. Don't shoot me. Ah, we gotta dodge these cops here. So they don't see me here. Okay, they're good. They're gone. I really don't understand how those are cops, though. There must be some kind of glitch or something. But we'll take care of that. All right. Hey. Base model E class, get out of here. I see some bad drivers, but you. Woo -hoo -hoo. All right, where's Amanda? She's down here somewhere. Top of the shop looking beat. Man, the paperwork. What you packing? 
You know, standard LSPD issue 9 mil. He's got my car! Shit! Alright, let's go! Let's go! Like, how are those cops? Go, Michael! Chill out! Jeez! Under Everywhere! Oh my god, what is this? Hello? No seatbelts? This is no ridiculous. I'm on top of it. Come on, come on! Come on! Oh my god, those guys are literally everywhere. What, what is I'm this? Doing. Under control. Yeah, it's under control. Relax, Amanda. Got this covered. Those how are those cops everywhere? I'm on top of it. You trying to kill me back here? Shit! They're still on us! Relax. We know I got this. Hey. Hey. They're coming, Michael! Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. Oh, so dramatic. I got this. Go, 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 go! Jeez. I know what I'm doing. I need to hide somewhere. Still three stars. Jeez. Oh, and the chopper's coming. Okay, I go left here. They better not come here. Ah, uh, we should be good here, right? Back up to the side here a little bit. No, he doesn't see us. Impossible for him to see us. Oh, there's cars, cars behind us. So nope, we gotta move. Drive around that. that All right, we're good. Are they gone? Of course they're gone. Who are you talking to? Come on, I'll take you back to the house. Yeah, that's where we pulled on the house. Don't say it. What? That I have everything I want. So why am I stealing? Oh, my lips are sealed. Cause if you say that, I'll say the same to you. I'm not saying anything. I'm just doing my best to keep us out of jail. Are we going home? I mean, who are you to judge me? Oh, I'm not judging? No, not at all. You're loving this, aren't you? Oh, yeah. Risking prison, getting shot at, love, love, big love. So this is what it's like to be you? Uh, not really, honey. See, I'm a semi-successful crook. You're a bit of a failure, but hey, kudos for trying. Not that successful if you're in witness protection. Well, I've got an idea. Why don't we see what Agent Dave and the FIB think of this Lovers on the Run act? Can we drive home, please? You know, I'm sort of... I'm sort of thankful for this. Thankful? This is the worst day of my life. <laughs> ah, come on, you're doing your part. Your spending habits have got us into a sticky financial situation, so you're cutting corners. Really? My spending habits? I've seen your day trader account. Oh, hey, that's private. I swear, password protection, it ain't even sacred no more. Give it up. You pissed our savings down the toilet. Get rid of the car, Michael. It can't stay in the driveway. Oh, Why not? Yeah. Thank you. Jeez. What a good thank you. Uh, let's get rid of this car. We'll park in somebody else's driveway or somebody else in this back alley. You know what? It was we didn't take the car. It was actually this dude. Yeah, he took the car. It wasn't us, sorry guys. Alright, uh, now we need to call our mechanic to get a car. Um, so then we need to get a suit as well, actually. I believe. So, let's call our mechanic and get us a nice whip. Alright, our mechanic. 
Today he dropped us off a F12, well, an F12 TDF. This gorgeous yellow. I'm not sure what he was thinking about the rims though. Uh, with that little lime green lip almost. I don't know what that's all about, but. This thing should be good though. So let's go see Lester. But I do believe we need to stop and get a suit first, right? And I know there's a shop here somewhere. Yes, I think this is where we are. You're a ride, stop about your ride. Alright, there's this shop right here. What a clean ride. All right. How are you? I'm good. How are you? We need a suit. Charcoal suit. Oh, geez. These are so expensive. You get the cheapest suit we got. Jeez. 300 bucks for a suit. All right. Cheapest suit we got, I think. Because everything else is... Sport codes, yeah, suit. Alright, we're low and long, earning low in cash now, so. Let's Bye. see what we gotta do here. Alright, where's Lester? Lester is all the way over here. Let's look at that banana straight shot. Now you see a lot of Lambos in the city, not a lot of Ferraris, so... Good thing our mechanic brought us something unique. Oh, this guy. Oh, I was so close to hitting that cop. Jeez, that was rough. Just flying through the lights. Oh, ah. Ah, let's go, let's go, let's go. That car was hard to see. Oh, no way. Paul Walker's back in town. Go, Beamer. Really, you want to do this right now? <laughs> yeah, let me get in my car. Oh my god, I just ran him over. I'm not here. I wasn't here to witness that. That was rough. Uh, I think we're right here somewhere. Yes. Of course, we're going to have priority parking here. We might as well reverse in. The back end of this car just looks amazing. Jeez, it looks so good. F12 TDF. I don't know how Michael can afford this. I'm assuming that's just be like on a the rental or a lease. Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail, the Union Depository. Now they say it cannot be hit. Has it been yet? Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we 
hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gems it is then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Idris crazies, they must <laughs> have just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was a... Uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City. Yeah, he went quiet. Yeah, Nico, right. Nico, Nico well, Bellic. Right? You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. Okay. Come on, we're not getting into that. Get out of here. Get into this. Come on, let's go. Jeez, really? We can't even get into that? Come on. I guess he can't fit. We're going to Little Portola. Either he can't fit or his back is too broken. Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back Oops. in business. FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. But for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Oh, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident. The shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. It's an inside job, almost. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm going to run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Oh, so that's that kind of job. I right, sounds good. Oh, why would you park so close to the corner? Use it as your own fault. Gotta call insurance for that damage. Jeez. My fake Chinese Audi. Okay, let's get this done. Bye. Right, it was a jewelry shop. Let's go. Uh, it sounds good what we have. Hi, how you doing? It's like a move. Hey, hello. No exit stuff. Fine, I'll go inside the store. Calm down. Jeez. Sir, thank you. Glasses are live. Shoot away. Alright, uh, security key counter. On the left when you come in. Uh, on the wall by the side door. Alright, what do we got here? Uh, surveillance and ventilation. Now all I'm after is the alarm. Uh, shots come through. Camera check. Alarm check. Vents check. Good work. Now speak to the assistant and see if there's anything else we need to know. Another camera. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe 10 grand. Our rings start at 8, our pendants start at 12. All right. I don't spend much, so but so 10k. Jeez. Or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. 
I'm gonna take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. Have a wonderful day. So, I wanna good? push the other door just in case. Eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Okay, uh, let's go grab him. I'm assuming, assuming he doesn't like being left alone for too long. Drive us around the block. We gotta find a way up to the roof. Find an access point, okay. Construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. I can go to the rooftop. What do we got? Hopefully, there's no construction guys in here. So you keep up with the old crew? Well, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? Him? Who's him? I saw a ladder. Climb up it and see if you can get to the roof. I kept tabs on him for a while. Needed to. Uh... Know that he didn't blame me. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. I'm on the roof. I need to know where the air coming out of those vents in Vangelico originates. There should be a unit above the store. Okay. Uh, let's jump over that. Hey, how's going? He's probably a John Doe then, right? What do you think? OD, shootout, maybe just a car crash, right? Anonymous charred remains on the highway. They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. Is he talking about the guy Trevor, I think? I'm assuming so. Up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. Hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? Uh, yes we can. I think it's gonna be higher. We've got our shot of the Vangelico unit. Looks good. Okay, that'll do. Come back to me before someone spots you up there. Will do. We just jump off the roof. <laughs> I feel like that would hurt a lot. Okay, that works. Uh, oh, that's a big drop. I exit, exit is right here, okay. If you take any longer, you're risking blowing this whole thing. Calm down, Lester. No, get off. Okay. We're coming down, we're coming down, don't worry. Alright, nobody saw us. We're good. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. So, what did you see? Nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. We might be able to wipe them remotely. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes to rub his nose in it. Uh, good. Alarm systems linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window. Someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. So I'd start there. Mm, glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof. Means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open then? Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. I might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. 
Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. <laughs> uh -huh. Funny. Lester always got this other thing. Ooh, TDF is still here. Sick. have their uses okay let me set this up <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed well we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow all the crews the roles prep work don't want to leave evidence behind on a hard drive so yeah the uh, methods don't change right not for a pro <laughs> well mapping out the options I'm showing you all the angles that's my Area of professional expertise. Making decisions. That is your domain, my friend. Here. Okay. So what do you have plan? What do you gotta do? There's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air mm -hmm. system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. We can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LS. SPD tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. Mm -hmm. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the LS River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? What should we do? Uh, I think we're going to do to make the most amount of money. Ah, you've grown wise smart. and cautious in your old age. Okay. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out mm -hmm. through the tunnels. So, I'm assuming we need a pretty good one then. Vehicle choice, yeah, 14%, but better intake. Eddie Toe. Let's do Eddie Toe. you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much difference. Norm Richards. Ah, Norm. Came across as a, a bit of an idiot, but could be useful. Hacker. Back office, but... This is the person who will determine how long you get inside. This guy, Ricky. I met him at the Life Invader office. He may not be that good, but he's enthusiastic. Mm, he's not that good, though. Paige Harris, he's got her, she's really good. Christian Feltz. <sighs> Ricky Lukens. Oh, who do we pick? Who do we pick? We want a good time window, so less cops. Mm, I think we should just go with Paige. Harris, <laughs> good feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. If you're happy, I'll start making the arrangements. I think we're good. Great. Uh, I'll do some research on a pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes, huh? good, good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa. What? My rep don't count for nothing no more. You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. <laughs> yeah, he's a dead man. His rep means nothing now. Ah, right, mission pass. What do we got? Yeah, our TDF is still here. Hey, what's up? Hey, man, it's me, Michael. What's going on? Listen, um, I gotta get hold of the money for that house we pulled down, so well, I'm getting a crew together for, uh, you can guess. The pay will be awful, and the risk will be high, but you might learn something if you're interested. 
Man, that's not exactly a great sales pitch, dog. but I guess I gotta start somewhere. Thank you. Maybe one day you could put together your own deals. Your own... jobs. So, there's still some preparation I gotta do. Sit tight for a while. My buddy Lester will get in touch with the details. Alright, okay, sounds good. So we got some prep to do. Uh, some different mission parts. And so I'm assuming we gotta take... We gotta get gas, coveralls, uh, I think that's it, I think, I think that's it, so, either way, that should be it, let's, uh, we'll call this an episode, we'll see you guys next time, make sure you hit the like button, hit the subscribe button down below, hit that notification bell so you know when these videos are coming out, and we'll see you guys next time, take it easy.